exclusive fashions are a big part of what we do, and here with styles that are good for everybody, Tracy Peart and Eva Griffin. <laughs> I want to start with the whole premise behind hashtag it fits me too. Why did you start this ladies? Well Tracy and I go to a lot of previews together and the problem is we can't find pieces that we can both fit into and we love the same pieces. Yes. So what we wanted to show was you can do it. You can go shopping with your best friend, with your mother, yeah. with your sister and get pieces that you both wear but fit your personal style. Right. That's the issue because yeah. when we would see something we both like, first of all we couldn't ever find it in, like in one store no. yeah. that fit us both and then we would style it differently. She's like, I'm going to wear it with that. I'm like, no, I would never wear it with that. I'm going to wear it with that. So then like, we're like, let's just kind of do something yeah, together. We're going to yeah. help promote companies that will size everyone. Who like are inclusive. the company like, that well, uh, created your skirt. Anthropology. Yes. It's so Anthropology, good. right? That Anthropology. is a good look. It's a very we beautiful do, skirt. We do, we know, we love it. Yeah, <laughs> no, it's good. It looks textured and amazing and chunky it and is. polished. It's, very, it's, it's perfect. perfect. Beautiful. Okay, so let's take a look at our uh, first two models coming out in the skirt that I covet. So I've been looking here, at it since it was on the rack. Yes, yeah, she really has. <laughs> here is Brianna and Laura. They are real life friends. Okay, they're wearing the real, real life friends. They're wearing the Cosima uh, flounce midi skirt in gold by Anthropology again. Mm. Okay, so what everybody knows Anthropology knows that they have beautiful pieces, but what a lot of people don't know is last spring they decided to extend their sizes, yeah. right? So they came up with an A plus collection that goes from size 16 to size 26. Good. So not only can you get petite sizing, standard sizing, you can also get plus sizing at Anthropology now. So it goes from zero all the way to 26. Very nice. Let's talk a little bit about the styling options here. You've done so them So I styled Brianna and I put her in this, look, look at the skirt first of all. Oh, I love it's it. It's in fall gold. I mean, I think this is beautiful for this time of year. It's a faux suede as a playful flounce hem with a high waist, right? Mm. Why this works on everybody is because it flares it at the bottom. So even if you carry your weight at the top, it's going to um, give you some um, weight at the bottom. If you carry your weight in the middle, it's still gonna flare out and give you that hourglass look. And if you carry your weight at the bottom, Bottom, it covers it. So mm. this type of skirt works on everybody and it's also a midi length. Yeah. So it works on all sorts of types of heights as well. Beautiful. And for me, what I wanted to do was, Laura's actually very straight. She doesn't have a lot of curves. And because there's a great weight to this skirt, it actually shows off her natural waist yeah. and the fact that it adds some dimension to her hips. I tucked in the sweater. Ladies, you can tuck in your sweater because if I left it untucked, she would just look round and mm -hmm. there would be no defined waist. So we defined her waist. Yeah. I added that beautiful pop of green on the throw because in, in Canada, we go from hot to cold in the US too. So I just want to be able to show you, you know what, you don't have to wear a coat, you can wear a beautiful yeah. wrap. And then I added the poppies and peonies bag in the yellow just to add more drama to it. And then I added the boot of the season, the python boot in that beautiful it. brown. Mm -hmm. And it goes, that those harvest, harvest colors look really mm -hmm. beautiful together. And then for a necklace, something very, very simple because you can wear a necklace with a chunky sweater. Absolutely. I just wanted to expound too on my look for yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I also wanted to tie and knot up the t-shirt because a lot of plus size women, a lot of curvy women think we can't do it. I, we want to have fun too. We want to join in on the trend as well. And I got this uh, ribbed beret from Anthropology as well. And the jacket and the shoes are from Additional. This jacket, look at it. It's beautiful. gorgeous. It's beautiful, beautiful, right? And it has a nice little waist. It's uh, and you can cinch it in. I thought it was look, it looked gorgeous. It's the color for fall, that kind of ox blood type of color. Yeah. And again, exciting news for Additional. They have extended their sizes as well, both directions. So they oh. used to just traditionally be a plus size store, but now they go up to size 36 and they start at size 10. This is amazing. Right. So it is amazing. Oh, I know and that. We've actually worn pieces together from Additional. Yeah. I've posted on Instagram. You yes. can see it's wearing the same pieces, same outfit, and it was totally by surprise. We didn't yeah. even know okay. we were doing it, and we just had to post at the same time, and we so, look great in it. Besties, go shopping. Yeah. yeah. Thank you. It's a beautiful thing. Hello, beauties. Who are these two gorgeous gals? So these are real life sisters. Yes. Gail and Leslie. You guys and, look great. And they're wearing jeans, the Send jeans from Universal Standard. Now, oh, nice. we did basics because we all need great jeans. And the reason we chose Universal Standard, they have zero, price, I mean, sizing from double zero yep. to 40. 
Ooh, Every single item from double zero yes. to 40. The most inclusive brand I'd say in the entire world. Okay, amazing. And they have lengths because I'm a tall girl. Mm -hmm. So their lengths and their jeans come in petite. Yes. 27 inch inseam, 30 inch inseam, 32 inch inseam. Good. So they have you covered. The boots again to that ox blood, which is huge this season yes. from Le Chateau. And then she's going out and we put her in a leopard print coat. And Gail's very, sorry, Leslie's very, very lean. Yes. And the reason um, I really want to put that coat on her, even though it's a bit oversized, because it fits Leslie in the shoulders, as you can see, it doesn't look too big. That's right. And that's the point. It needs it to is. fit the shoulders, and 100%. then the rest is fine. Then it looks sloppy if it doesn't. That's right. And this jacket, the sleeve comes off. Let's show oh, Leslie. Oh, that's cool. So oh, for tall nice. girls, you want to put your hands up so they can see the difference. So look how oh. the size, the length difference oh, on those I see. sleeves. For the long arms. The long arms, because yeah. that's something I struggle with all the time myself. Me too. And I'm always putting them up. But that cabbie jacket, yeah. you can wear it both ways if you're tall or if you're short. And it has you covered. That's very cool. And I love the fact that it's great for evening as well. Yes, it is. You can wear that coat in a million different ways. Let's talk about lovely Gail now. Well, I know you, you curvy ladies thought I forgot about you when it comes to the python boot, but I didn't. <laughs> this is the boot of the season. And what I want to really focus on is Curvy women want to join in on the trends yes, as well. So a trend. lot of the time, and there's a tall boot trend. We just have to like sit that one out because a lot of the times we can't go into a regular store yeah. and just go get a tall boot. We can't get it to go over our calves. Yes. Okay. Yeah. So these boots are from Additionnel. They have a wide width for the calves. So I'm telling you, ladies, we can join in on the on the trend as well. Yeah. And they also go up to size 12 in the shoe. Good. So again, being very inclusive. Now you can see that she's uh, and also with a tip, she's also petite in height. Mm -hmm. so so a lot of issue that women who are petite as well as plus size having to uh, having um, to find a taller boot, yeah. it's an issue. So you want to make sure that you're, the top of your boot is one inch. Um, at least one inch away from the um, bottom of your kneecap. Okay. If it's too tall, it's going to cut the leg in half yeah. and make your lo leg look even shorter. So that's a tip. And you and you can see she's wearing the same universal standard jeans, but it's, what a tip for a plus size women is you want to keep it solid yeah. and keep it a dark wash because it elongates the leg. Okay. If she was wearing something with a lot of distress and rips and bells and whistles, it would cut the leg in half and the boot is already going to do that. So you want to make sure that you don't do that. The jacket is also from Additionnel. Again, you want to stay with the trends. You want to keep trendy. A good uh, tip for a moto jacket is to is where it falls. So if it's too um, high and too short, yeah. it makes you look hippie if you're curvy. If it's too long, you look boxy. Right. So what I think it needs to hit you right at the top of the waist right here. So it needs to graze right there. That's the perfect length in order for it to be um, really cute. And then we just paired it with the um, Poppy and Peony's uh, clutch here. Cute. That's vegan leather. Yes. Right? Very so nice. very, very nice. I'm so shocked you pulled a moto coat. <laughs> That's an inside sarcastic. joke. It's an inside joke. I wear There's, a lot of moto coats. She's never seen one? a moto coat she doesn't love. <laughs> <laughs> she loves them. Listen, I, do. I love all of the styles. I love that you all can go shopping together. Thank you, ladies. That was amazing. <laughs>